G'day, I'm Ashley from Web Marine and I'm here aboard the new Sailfish Canyon Master, new model for 2013. Come on board and have a look. Starting from the stern, you can see we've powered this boat with a pair of 135 Honda four stroke outboards. This boat will accommodate though uh, horsepower ranges from 90 through to 135 a side, so the flexibility there is great. Also got dual bullhorn hydraulic steering, so one steering ram for each engine. At the transom, we've got a generous live bait tank, readily accessible. On the starboard side, we've got a welded cutting board, which is great. It's something that's sturdy to hang on to. Um, I'm a 100 kilos, I'll admit to, and you can lean on it quite comfortably. Uh, you've got the transom walkout all the way to the stern, and the door at the back of the boat here leads also for a great area for fighting fish off the back here as well. Two convenient rod holders and three more down each side. The boat has 175 litre fuel tanks each side, so for a total of 350 litres. The floor you can see is a massive cockpit area, a great open fishing plan. The saltwater deck wash is standard on the starboard side. Convenient grab handles for fishing as well and nice wide side deck so if you do want to sit down on the side it's a comfortable area to sit down as well. The way we've set up all these side pockets is so you've got plenty of tow under room here for fighting a fish. The rolled edges on the gunnels here make it very very soft even though there's no padding to lean up against. We have deliberately haven't put padding here to ensure that cleaning is easy and there's no hooks risking getting caught into your upholstery. On this boat, as we do on most of our boats, we have a non-skid uh, paint chip flooring on this, which is sensational. It's cooler than carpet. It's non-skid rated. Uh, it's very easy to clean. It doesn't show the dirt. It's just simple hose out at the end of the day. Straight through the, uh, the self-draining deck, which all sailfish boats have. On the driver's side, we've got a sensational kill box, which is what some people were demanding uh, as a step up from our shelf runner. We also have a fold down companion seat here behind the passenger side. So uh, that seat folds up and allows that one extra person to have a nice seated area. This of course is a draining fill tank. The driver's side and passenger side seats are flip up bolsters. So you've got the sit down or sit up bolster. Also here, conveniently located, is a nice ice box for all your drinks and food. The helm's set up for uh, spending long hours driving your boat. Everything is conveniently located. You've got plenty of room on the dash for the latest big screen electronics. All your instrument instrumentation is easy to read. Compass, you've got your electro electric anchor winch control, which is a drum winch on this one with free fall. Your switch panel, VHF radio, dual binnacle controls to feed the Hondas. On the passenger side, who's in charge of music over there, you've got the Fusion iPod stereo system. Moving through the forward cabin, we've got a nice sliding door, a lockable for security as well. Leads through to a more generous cabin than in her smaller sister ship, the Shelf Runner. Also has a provision in there for the port loop this bedding area is quite generous for two people to sleep overnight. You have a total width of just under two meters and a depth of about 1250. So quite comfortable to spend a night or two out on the water. With the overwhelming success of the hardtop option on the shelf front of the smaller boat to this, this Canyon Master is now standard with uh, enclosed glass hardtop with a windscreen wiper and sliding glass windows on the side. You have a roof mounted hatch to get all the hot air out of the cabin. So you've got great ventilation between the side windows and the roof hatch in your cabin. It keeps it nice and cool. Um, you can see we've got seven welded rod holders on the rocket launcher here. You also have LED floodlights. We have one light that services the open area cockpit of the boat. The secondary light here sends a longer throw for if you're fishing at night or you're moving into a marina or something like that. So you've got two different angles on those lenses. You also got very very convenient passenger grab rails here for those guys that like to stand, uh, passengers that like to stand on their way out to the fishing grounds. So that's a brief rundown of the new Sailfish Canyon Master. Now let's do the fun part and take it for a run.